As we continue our focus on Hispanic Heritage Month, tonight we look at low rider culture. It started in Los Angeles in the 40s and has since become an international phenomenon. It's also a big part of the culture in San Jose where low rider magazine was created more than 45 years ago. KTVU South Bay reporter La Monica Peters live now in San Jose with a man who teaches low rider culture. La Monica. Ricardo Cortez says that low riding is about style and taking pride in building something unique. So through his low rider tech workshop and his children's book, he wants to keep the tradition alive for the next generation. I'm a member of New Style Car Club, which was established in 1974. Low riding is a family affair for Ricardo Cortez and his father-in-law, Robert Gutierrez. Cortez says low rider culture is an important part of Chicano or Mexican American history in California. I think the, the most beautiful part about it is that this was an innovation that was created in the barrios of Chicanos. And now we see how globalized this culture, this lifestyle has become from California, all the way to Japan. Last year, Cortez created the 408 Art Lowrider Workshop for Teens as a creative ambassador for the city of San Jose. Cortez has also written a children's book, The ABCs of Lowriding, which explains the history, technology, and important people in lowrider culture. This is Sonny Madrid, founder of Lowrider Magazine in 1977. He's from San Jose, went to San Jose State University, and right after that, he started the magazine and it's all about style, about attitude, um, and kind of being a representation of yourself um, as a manifestation through a vehicle. Cortez and the United Lowrider Council of San Jose also believe lowriding is often judged unfairly. They say most lowriders follow traffic laws and simply want to show off their customized cars. After San Jose lifted its 30-year cruising ban, the council is now lobbying to lift cruising bans across the state. Instead of fighting every city one at a time, now we're one big swoop just to repeal it, the whole state. Assembly Bill 436 will legalize cruising statewide and is awaiting the governor's signature. Now, in the meantime, Cortez says that he will keep creating and educating people about lowrider culture. Julie? La Monica Peters reporting live tonight in the South Bay. La Monica, thank you. And